y'all had watched some of the earlier videos, uh, I'd bought a new piece of equipment, PRI. Uh, been working with it for the last month, uh, testing some things, and I've learned quite a bit about these items. I'll show you what I bought here in just a second. In the four weeks that I've been testing with it, I've learned more in four weeks than I learned in four or five years listening to what people have told me and trusting what people have done for me. So here is what I have bought. It's an injector fuel flow bench to test injectors. It is a pretty functional setup. You can do all kinds of tests with it. You know, ultrasonic cleaning setup it's got with it. Uh, backwash system to actually flush the injectors after you clean them. Uh, leak test it. Uh, let's see, there's a coil test. So there's multiple things that can be done with it. I've been playing with it. Uh, this set of injectors I've got on it right now are a thousand dollar set of injectors a customer had bought. Uh, for his motor that I do and you know the motors ran good and we really haven't had any issues but the tuning has been a little bit I wouldn't say hard but it's been harder than it should have so he offered to check his injectors for him and so I could learn a little bit about how this thing works and he brought his injectors and I've run them quite a bit on the bench at uh, numerous different RPMs and milliseconds and it's been very enlightening on why we've had to tune his motor like we have and what we've had to do to get the motor tuned up like it should have been. So I'm go back and show y'all how close a set of match flow injectors are or, or aren't. So let me get some tests set up here and we'll go through some stuff. I'll show y'all what uh, what the real truth is. Okay, I've got a test set up here now. Uh, it's gonna run 1,000 RPM to 8,000 RPM, starting at 1.5 milliseconds, running to three milliseconds. And the test is 40 seconds long. It goes through the test up and then to 8,000 and then it will go from 8,000 back to 1,000. So let's start it here and I'll show you what happens. Take a second for the pressure to stabilize. That's a test right there. Okay, let's, let's see what we got here. Get things a second to settle down. One thing I have noticed, I watched on YouTube a bunch of the other people that have tested injectors. Not all of them, but a lot of them, they have a lot of foam in their tubes. And, you know, I don't know what they're using for fluid, but this here does not seem to foam up like theirs. Uh, this one is 84. 79, 82, 79, 82, 80, 78, looks like about 87. So that is supposed to be a match set of injectors. Uh, let me dump the tubes here. And while that's draining down, we'll go back here now let's just change our setup here. We'll just run a test, say at 2,000 RPM steady, two milliseconds, 
for 30 seconds and see what kind of results we get. Like it does before it stabilizes the pressure, make sure everything's stable before it starts. here we got 30 about 28 30 28 30 28 uh, probably 27 and we have 30 down here so they're still not consistent uh, let's do another test here Let's do a 5,000 RPM test, two milliseconds for 30 seconds. Let's quit. Uh, 65, 60, 63, 60, 63, probably 62, 60, 66. So, so far, I have not seen anything. Get it turned around here proves to me that this is a match set of injectors. No matter how you run them, uh, there's always a different flow from one to the other. I hope that kind of explains a few things there to some people. I'll probably do some more with it. Uh, I just need to kind of figure out what uh, kind of tests I need to show and explain. If you have any comments, or suggestions uh, feel free to put them in the comment section and I will see what I can do with this setup you really can't tell how to tune the motor but at least you know what kind of fuel flow you've got with your injectors and you can manipulate each individual injector to flow what it needs to flow and know how much you're changing it when you do change it so I appreciate everybody watching. Uh, have a good day. Thank you. Bye.